Well, tonight, lawmakers appear to be embracing a deal that would avoid another government shutdown. But the deal would not fully fund the president's border wall, though. Right, which is raising questions about whether the president will sign it. Here's Local 24 News reporter Mark Meredith from our exclusive Washington Bureau. I don't think you're going to see a shutdown. But President Trump says he's not happy with a border security bill backed by a bipartisan group of lawmakers. I'm not happy about it. It's not doing the trick. The president had demanded $5 billion for a border wall, but under the agreement reached Monday, Congress says it'll spend $1.3 billion for 55 miles of a border barrier. Senate leaders from both parties are urging President Trump to support the deal. The president should sign this bill. I have recommended that if, the, if it becomes what we think it is, I do recommend he sign it. Lawmakers say the deal includes an additional $1.7 billion for the Department of Homeland Security. And while that money wouldn't go towards a wall, lawmakers say DHS would be able to use that money to beef up current border security checkpoints. Lawmakers have until Friday night to pass a funding bill to avert a shutdown, but the president says no matter what lawmakers decide, he's not done fighting for the wall. It's all going to happen where we're going to build a beautiful, big, strong wall. He says he could still declare an emergency on the border and order the military to begin building the wall. Reporting from Washington, I'm Mark Meredith, Local 24 News.